Hey guys, it's Greg, and welcome back to another free WordPress tutorial on YouTube. Today we're going to answer Muhammad's question, and I want to say thanks so much, Muhammad, for taking us on a blast to the past from our e-commerce website video in 2017. And Muhammad obviously wants to know how to add other fields to the contact form. So let's get right to it. We have our website here that Muhammad was referring to. Still working great, still loading super fast, and actually probably still a really good e-commerce website for today if you need to sell anything online or make an online store. Here's the contact form that we want to add something to. And here we are in our dashboard plugins. So this form, like many forms, you'll see was made with contact form seven. To add a field, we just need to go to its settings. And then we're gonna come over to the contact form we made. So there's like some default ones, but the top one is just the one that we inserted into the website. And here we go. So we can see some of the nuts and bolts and guts and all of the form. So how do we add stuff to it? Well, you could just kind of copy something like this and then paste it beneath and see what happens. I don't mind trial and error at all, or you can just change the wording. But the best practice is actually to go to form. And here in form, we can understand a little bit of what's going on with this plugin and what the developers actually made for us. So this is a much simpler view too, which I love. We can see that our form has your name, your email, your message, and a submit button. And now if we wanted to add something like say a telephone number beneath the email, we could just make a couple spaces and we could hit tell. Then go ahead and change the name from this weird number dash thing to something like your telephone, just so it's easier for you to look at. If you wanna make it required, you can there and then click enter tag. All right, so we can see what's happening is we've made this part of the form, but there's also a label. So we can just go ahead and copy the label part, which was created for us by contact form seven, thanks very much you guys. And there's also a closing P tag here. So we're gonna keep the formatting as consistent as possible. And now let's save it and see what it made. And we'll just refresh. All right, and if you refresh your site and your new field doesn't show up, could be because there's some errors in the form which need adjusting. Let's check out our configuration errors that show up in the mail by that red exclamation mark. And to figure out what to enter in this mail tab, I opened up another one of the contact forms that was already made for us. And we're just gonna copy in these default values, which you can use too. Just replace them like with your own email and domain name. So we've entered in the to field, from field, subject field, additional headers, and the message body. And we're gonna save it. And now that we've pleased the contact form here, and there's no more errors, I'm just gonna change our label to telephone because we don't need two emails. And save that. And refresh our site. If you're still not seeing your changes, try to go ahead and delete the cache. And if it's been a while since editing your site, there might just be a few things stuck there. Deleting the cache should clear all the pipes and now your changes will come through. And that, my friends, is a rather long-winded explanation on how to add fields to your contact form in WordPress. Good thing is we did it with contact form seven, which is by far the most used free contact form solution for your WordPress websites and blogs. So you can get as detailed as you want and you can of course create crazy huge forms for your clients or to have people log into a site or submit an inquiry or maybe refer them to a different site. The choice is yours, so go ahead and enjoy it. Hope you learned something here. If you did, it'd be great if you could hit that like button. That'd mean a lot to me. And of course, please subscribe so you can stay in touch with all our free WordPress help. I'm Greg Ryan. Thanks for watching.